Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is the Mundo. You, at this current time, your current GWF Tag Team Champion. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is the first ever Mundo Raw Uncooked, Uncensored. They've given me five minutes to really say whatever I like. And well, where do we start, ladies and gentlemen, by today's video? Yes, there's no editing on this. I'm going straight from the hip. It's... The 2K rant. Yes, I've wanted to do this for a long time. And, well, today is going to be that day, I guess. It's uh, going to be full of me just ranting on about 2K and all their shit, really. And when you say shit, what do you mean shit? Well, recently this week, YouTubers have been posting 2K17 videos. Nothing against them guys. They, they make good content. Don't watch most of them. But they make content and they get what they deserve. They've got a huge fan base. And congratulations to them. What I don't like is 2K. Now, 2K in the past are very, very up themselves. Up themselves as in that they don't care about the casual fan. They don't, they don't seem to care about the product overall. What they're caring about is making money. And yes, business is all about making money. And I understand that. But... Let's look at community creations. It has not worked in nearly two months. That is a product that is out at the moment that has not worked properly for two months. And 2K even sent an email round to some people saying, we're not going to fix it. We're concentrating on 2K17. That is ridiculous. Ever since the game became free on Xbox, uh, Xbox, Xbox One and 360, I think it was, they, they just haven't given a crap. The, the servers never work. It, it's ridiculous. Uh, as a company, they just don't seem to care about the product. And for that, is it's a disgrace. that. And also, they're now going to be charging £80 for the NXT edition, which at the moment, I've been told, you don't even get the season pass. So there's an extra 20 quid. Yes, I'm an idiot. I love wrestling games. The reason I love wrestling games is because I create wrestling videos i've done it for three years i create my own efed i've got a great bunch of people at Go uh, global gaming who back me up and they and i help them out and they're a great bunch of lads but we'd get no recognition because why simple because we're not big enough we're not we can't grow because 2k seem to have their own little in for it factor their own little people that they want to sort of help along and don't seem to want to help any, any other one, anybody else they don't retweet we put the truth we put their their hash their name in every one of our, our tweets when we say look guys we've got a show tonight come and watch how many times have they retweeted us in three years once once in three years and that ladies and gentlemen is an absolute travesty to be honest it's it just shows you that if you are a, a, a big YouTuber, you get everything you want in life. It's the same with EA Sports. EA Sports are exactly the same. KSI can rip on EA Sports for a whole year. Tell them they're the shittest company in the world. What happens when it comes to the new game? Ah, why not invite KSI along to spend 15 million coins on, on, a, on a fake, on a fake uh, account so he can make more money? The rest of them? What about them? Nothing. And that is, ladies and gentlemen, the, the problem with YouTube, the problem with YouTubers and 2K they do, and EA Sports, it's terrible. You tell me how any of these companies can get away with it. Really, yes, I know what you're going to say. Yes, but they're allowed to do that. They're allowed to pick whoever they want. Fair enough. But they never seem to give the people who put hard work into it, like anything they don't answer the casual fan that's what i mean to me you may be thinking yeah mundo you're just bitter because you don't get the early access everyone gets it two weeks and you get nothing i may be you may be right but the thing is i i'm still gonna buy the game i'm paying 80 pound for the nxt edition doesn't mean that i can i can't be upset that they can't fix community creations we spend i'm countless hours making videos but yet once again a don't uh, sorry 2k don't care a bit and that's the thing that pees me off they're more they're more oh look at this look at this youtuber who's made great videos today 
yeah, but why are you not fixing 2K16 for the rest of us? No, because look at this. Look, look at all these entrances for 2K17. Yeah, but we're still waiting for community creations to be fixed. No, 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 no. Come on, guys. Buy 2K17. When? And look at this. Look at this guy. Look at this guy making loads of good, cool stuff. Yeah, but we're still waiting. Two months. And it's never going to work. Nothing's going to happen. So that is the problem, guys. Problems with 2K. Companies overall. They just want you to spend money. They don't give a care about their product. So it's always going to be the same. I would love 2K to answer it. But of course, when I had done NSW, my other eFed, it, it crashed twice. Twice. It's tw three times, actually. Twice on Xbox One and once on 360. The whole save corrupted. What did he... What did he say? It's made his mad now. 2K say? I'll oh, submit a ticket. Oh, but I'm sure... I'm sure one of the big YouTubers did it. I'm sure they wouldn't be that. I'm sure they'd be the head of the queue. You'd be sending them 10 more copies. Well, anyway, guys, I have to wrap this up. Thanks very much for listening. This has been the 2K and really gaming in general rant. I am the Mundo. I am your champ. I'll see you soon.